वेलकम एवरी वन टू अवर नेक्स्ट सेशन फॉर अंडरस्टैंडिंग वुडवर्ड फिशर रूल फॉर डिटर्मिनेशन ऑफ लैमडा मैक्स इन दिस सेकेंड सेशन वी विल बी अंडरस्टैंडिंग वुडवर्ड फिशर रूल फॉर डिटर्मिनेशन ऑफ लैमडा मैक्स फॉर अल्फा बीटा अनसेचुरेटेड कंपाउंड वी हैव ऑलरेडी अंडरस्टूड सम बेसिक टर्म्स ऑफ वुडवर्ड फिशर रूल for calculating lambda max for 13 butadiene system in our earlier session so now let us see this is the conjugated diene system which we are studying today so why we are calling it as conjugated diene first thing we are calling it as diene because there are two double bonds present and since those two double bonds are in conjugation we call it as conjugated diene and such conjugated diene for such structures the lambda max can be calculated using the rules given by woodward and fisher so let us start numbering the first carbon on which the double bond is present second carbon third carbon and the fourth atom is oxygen since this is carbonyl group we let us name the carbon as alpha carbon and beta carbon so the system is little different from 13 butadiene system which we had seen earlier which we have learned earlier so now these colored bonds which we see and the carbon which are colored and the oxygen atom this is our basic moiety we will see other attachments present on this basic moiety which will contribute for the absorption let me put it in different words in simple words the colored part which you see now the red color carbon pink color bond and oxygen that is the minimum requirement of such compound for giving absorbance in uv region now whatever are the attachments on these carbons means alpha beta carbons whatever are the substitutions present on this core moiety will cause increase in absorption in uv region let us understand more these are the base values for acyclic alpha beta unsaturated ketones that is 215 nanometers now what is base value what do we mean by base value that we have already seen in our previous session of woodward fisher rule the second form of alpha beta unsaturated system could be six membered cyclic ketones for this also base value is 215 nanometer the third kind of alpha beta unsaturated system could be five membered cyclic ketones for which the base value is 202 nanometers fourth type of alpha beta unsaturated system could be aldehydes for which base value is 210 nanometer and the last type of alpha beta unsaturated system could be acids and esters for which the base value is minimum that is 195 nanometers all these base values have been referred from the reference given below you can see position of alpha and beta carbons in each of this type of alpha beta unsaturated system the alpha carbon is always adjacent to carbonyl group and we name that carbon as beta which is adjacent to alpha carbon let us now understand alkyl substitutions ring residues and extended conjugations for alpha beta unsaturated system now this is our basic system the colored carbons pink color bonds and oxygen atom now this green color bond which you see that is called as the alkyl substitution now if such bond is 
a part of any ring then we call that bond as a ring residue now if there is third double bond present in the system if there is third double bond present in the system and that too is in conjugation with the earlier basic moiety then we call that double bond as an extended conjugation and because of this extended conjugation our basic moiety basic system extends up to delta carbon so now what we have in our basic system we have first the carbonyl group then alpha carbon beta carbon gamma and delta carbon now what extra things we see on the carbons of the system we see on alpha carbon there is bond and on delta carbon there is bond those bonds i have shown in green color these bonds are called as ring residues at alpha carbon and delta carbon unlike 1,3 butadiene system the incremental values for ring residue and alkyl substitution are different in 1,3 butadiene system the ring residue and alkyl substitutions increase absorbance by 5 units but in alpha beta unsaturated system if the ring residue or alkyl substitution is present at alpha position the absorbance increases by 10 units if ring residue or alkyl substitution is present at beta position absorbance increases by 12 units whereas if ring residue or alkyl substitution is present at gamma delta and higher positions the absorbance increases by 18 units we have already seen what is extended conjugation each extended conjugation increases absorbance by 30 units exocyclic double bonds increases absorbance by 5 units and presence of homoannular system or homoannular unit we can also call it as homodyne compound increases absorbance by 39 units what is exocyclic bond and what is homoannular unit that we have already learned in our first session of woodward fisher rule for determination of lambda max for 1,3 butadiene system the rules for identifying exocyclic double bond extended conjugation and homoannular unit are same for 1,3 butadiene system as well as for alpha beta unsaturated system thank you for your patient listening in our next session we will try to calculate lambda max for simple organic compounds using these rules thank you have a nice time